And they are Here underway. Wow, Second that happened so started. fast. We are in game six. It is now Ray Robson who is in a must-win situation for the first time in his two matches against Wesley Sol. And once again, they are playing this Queen's Gambit. I was going to say, why don't you just trade Queens, Wesley? Why allow Queenie to and uh, mucking about? And he did. He just traded and said, okay, I'm in this ending that I've played Oops, almost all my going? life. Bishop is seven. They should be e7. Castles. I think like good luck to win this ending. Exactly. Just good luck. Uh, if you do a database search of these four versus four, two versus two positions, inevitably you're going to find 100 games of Wesley So in this ending. He has played it <laughs> backwards and forwards, Sounds left to really right. Sounds not really promising for Ray. No, 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 no. I just... You know, whoever, I mean, I really think it's like Magnus is the only person who really, you know, somehow tickles uh, Wesley. Wesley is, is almost unbeatable in these positions. He's really very, very impressive. So, uh, obviously, from Wesley's perspective, you bring your rooks to the center, and you start making as many, you, you hack the pieces off, yeah. to quote Jonathan Spielman. Knight to d4. Well, this is the hacking is already underway. Yeah, these type of positions are so difficult to create anything for either side. They're so Indeed. dry. Exactly. So this is, surprises me a bit. Why uh, Ray chose White's, this opening? Exactly. Why it's an opening choice? But perhaps you know this is the end of this match. This is the end, close to the end of the tournament. You're running out of ideas. Right. I mean, you've been playing everything <laughs> under the sun. <laughs> Seven days. Uh, right up to this moment. <laughs> And we see what, I, what I'm saying about just hacking the pieces off last move was bishop to d5. I'm assuming this knight at a certain moment is about to jump and allow for bishop f6. This bishop on d4 kind of uh, ho holding things up. Whoa, 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 whoa. F3, he wants to whoa. push e4. Um, Bring his king. Who's undermining whom? Mm -hmm. I was about to say knight e8. You're welcome to play. E4, I would take. Ooh, okay, knight, bishop, a8. But what am I saying? I'm, I apologize. I was thinking rook takes d4 is on tap and bishop c5. Wrong. Uh, a small pawn. A small pawn in the way. Yeah, so e4, probably e4. he wants to bring his king a little bit closer. Um, king f2, king e3. Knight d7, bishop f6. Knight d7. Return the favor, yeah. Knight d7, maybe f6, c5. E5, yes. H6, okay. Okay, that is a very, very chill move. Time to bring the king. King f2, you mean? Yes. Okay. Look at time actually raised. King f1? Yes. Okay. Half a minute mm -hmm. less only. G5. So Wesley Somewhat wants to play on that side. Somewhat indication that the f4 square is the promised land, or he just wants to put his knight back and his knight is bishop on f6 so that his knight can come to e5. Yes, Wesley. <coughs> Defending the c5 square as well. Bishop f6 on his agenda. Rook d2. d2. Mm -hmm. yeah, he wants to double his rook on d4. Let's double up and Wesley f5. tries to wow. open up his light square f5. bishop. I don't think he plays for, for a draw. <laughs> yeah, somebody game. has to remind Wesley all you yes, need is a draw. <laughs> exactly. I mean, f5 is kind of an inspired move. I don't know if it's a good move. Just trying Take to make it. the best moves uh, in the position. I like centralizing the king, king e7. But with those rooks on the d5, fortunately, fortunately, there's some discovery the, stuff happening. No, no, the business squares are covered. Because bishop is protecting everybody. Everybody. Yes. Mm -hmm. you're King too e7. Confident. You're too confident, yes. Sir. How about bishop d5 is another move. King f7. <laughs> I mean, Wesley's channeling his inner Yasu. <laughs> no, 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 no. This is Wesley uh, doing his thing. He is a specialist in these positions. That? Bishop to d5. And then? I have some knight b7 ideas bishop if you go bishop e6. That is true. I don't know, I'm starting to like white. Look how many pieces are on the d file, by the way. <laughs> uh, he needs bishop uh, on d6 and then we're hard. completed, yes. <laughs> That's by the way, he goes to e6, e6 allows e6. knight b7. Uh, knight to b7, the rook. Just would, rook somewhere. I am assuming we'll just move somewhere. 
I would like to transition my roots <coughs> on the E file now, if I can. The problem is I don't know if I have time. Yeah, maybe I have to start gonna be a with tempo. There's going to be a tempo against the bishop. To well, that gives Wesley the moment. The tempo he Actually, needs to play knight f6. There is an idea to take yes. this bishop on a six after rook e2 and then bishop a2 where the king goes, you know, some kind of. Yes. <laughs> but it's maybe knight too deep. Yes. E5. I, I That's ambitious. Knight ah, a5. He wants d2, to go rook d2, rook knight c1. c4. That's a move that I'm sure both players missed. You can take a pawn with bishop takes f5, but I don't think that's going to be enough. Uh, the dream. You might want to do it. Just Maybe because. Because there's it not many five. alternatives. Yes. Bishop takes e5, and so there is West no bishop. So Wesley sacrificed a pawn mm -hmm. for, for the, two, the two bishops. Um, beyond that, I'm not exactly sure why he needed to play knight e5. Knight f8, knight f6, both look, look at reasonable. At least there's some imbalance. But he traded in the some pieces also. True. Mm -hmm. So should I take on d2 and play a move like rook c2? Yeah, I think he wants to move bishop. No, but bishop f6 doesn't make any sense. If I, if I play rook c2, uh, trade on d2 and play rook c2, or king e6 first, followed by... This is what he's doing, rook c1 first. Rook c1 and first. And then he can... King f2, king e6. Right, and then I'm thinking somewhere... I want to get rid of this rook. Do you go to g7? Because this knight is a little bit nasty or on a5. Or to b2, where do you go? Do you stay active or... I would go to b2. d4, okay. So I can play rook c2 and then hunt down this knight to try to get bishops of opposite colors. That's 20 seconds against 40. Here we go. We're coming to, Once to, again, <laughs> the, to the moment of wait, 15 wait. seconds 14. I mean, Ray has to play and quickly. Just to remind everybody, Ray must win. Yes, There's he has no a alternative. Up. But so I, I would go rook c2 right now. Rook c2 right now. And guess what? Yes, <laughs> you played this move. Yeah, that was a very professional And they move. go for these two bishops against knight and bishop But now I go bishop c5, right? And bishop f6. Nothing. Yeah, bishop f6. King How do you corral that knight, though, to force me to go knight c5? <coughs> uh, not easily. G3. He's trying to create at least a pass pawn. Exactly. Bishop to d1. Bishop, no. F4. No, now the no 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 no. Now there's no way of using using the um, um, majority. I don't like bishop f5. I like the bishop on b3. But how do you get? Uh, just keep four seconds, guys. We're forgetting Here about we go. the time. Bishop, no, four bishop seconds d8. Against 20. Bishop Two d8 seconds, and bishop b6. Check. Wesley had the match in his hands. Yes, he did. Bishop d8 and bishop b6 check. My knight is coming won. back. My knight is coming back, no. guys. No, bishop a4. He's saying no. No, the knight I is don't, not coming back. I don't like the. He's trying to bishop d8. Bishop d8 once again. <laughs> wow, h4. h4. Bishop d8. H, bishop, bishop d8. d4. Oh, he's found it. That was a clincher. Yes, and then this it's is now this is over. Now yes. Wesley. Bishop goes to g1. Yes. Correct. That's why he bishop put his pawn on h3. Yeah, and it's 13 seconds to black. five, and he's already thinking about it. Absolutely brilliant. Bishop G1, Bishop G1 gives the piece away, but that is going to be a queen on the H file. Wesley. He is ready to give up. That's a queen. And we he think flagged Ray again. flagged. And look at Ray, disconsolate. As wow. wow. Whew. And Wesley so wins this. Emerges race. out of the elimination bracket. <laughs> Wesley so, yeah. the Vulneronian, will play for all the marbles. Back in the grand finals. Wow. Wow. Once again, I got to congratulate you on your picks. <laughs> <laughs> but mean, here we go. It's, it's going to be a fight. <laughs> yes. Wow, Wesley. Wesley.